born in Australia, I grew up in Wainui. I spent most of my time chucking a ball around at the Wainui Rugby League Club with my mates and all my cousins and that. All my family are from there, so it's a, quite a small little suburb, so we're all quite close to each other. Coming from Wainui, Piriwepu and Namia Te Alata were the two guys that I guess all the kids in Wainui wanted to be like. Wainui is quite well known for rugby league. John Lomax. My dad and all his brothers played for the Wainui Rugby League Club. Sure Those were the guys that I sort of looked up to and wanted to be like. Gee, what a hit. That was a Wainui Amata special. And that's a try. I played rugby league all throughout my childhood and um, it was a game that I first fell in love with. So I was 15 when we first moved back to Australia. I went to a rugby union school, which sent him in college in Canberra. That's what all my mates were doing over there, so I decided to play it. Probably wasn't until I moved to Australia that I played rugby union. It's crazy to think, but yeah, I'm not too sure if I stayed in New Zealand if I would have been playing rugby union. Probably be playing for the, hopefully the minor rugby league club. <laughs> I love my time in Australia, so it's probably the first experience of moving out of home and, you know, sort of growing up. My first year of Super Rugby, I got a little bit of recognition from the Wallabies and sort of made me think, you know, geez, is that what I want to do? I guess had a chat to my family and my partner and sort of decided that New Zealand would probably be the best place for me to play rugby. I actually had a chat with the Hurricanes back then, but I was a bit, I was, you know, I guess I was 21. Coming home probably wasn't the right time for me. I sort of wanted to go to a place where I could just focus on rugby and not have anything else to worry about. So I sort of isolated myself down in Dunedin a little bit. I love my time with the Highlanders. I learned so much down there. A great team, a great environment, and great culture. It was a really good two years down there. Well done, Tyrell Lomax. It's coming to the end of my second year, and I was coming into contract negotiations for the next few years, and I was looking at where I'd play for the next four years. From being a little kid, going and watch them at the Westpac Stadium to being able to play there in front of the crowd, in front of my family, it's a big thing. A lot of the players I grew up watching. Dan Coles, and I grew up watching him scoring tries like wingers. Obviously TJ, he's pretty inspirational. Being able to play alongside them would be pretty cool. You know, this is home for me and I love being here. So I guess having a second chance to come here was a dream come true for me.